Hey everyone, SG Caper here. Really need to start doing some custom videos because, I mean, that's the name of my channel, right? SG Capers Customs. Uh, but I haven't had a lot of time to do that. I have been buying stuff, so I figure I'll do some more review videos. I just picked this up this morning. Uh, Fortnite Deadfire versus Mega Cube Brute. I bought it for this figure because I like the size of it. So... Let's open it up. Alright. I mean, I didn't really have to tear the box open. is torn in pieces which is fine because it'll just go in the recycle bin it needs to be broken down anyways otherwise they take them out of our recycle bin so there's that and everything just fell out all right so we got well i'll come to that guy next here's the first guy kind of a sorry i mean to bump the camera sort of a cowboy looking guy he's got the ridiculous shotgun that will get added to a bag of parts. Uh, cool sculpt. I don't like the colors, but the, the sculpt is cool. Uh, neat jacket, cool gloves. It's a typical Fortnite figure on the regular articulation we expect from a modern figure. Really like the jacket. Uh, like the boot details. I like it. Uh, on this figure, I feel like the one thing I would do is swap out the legs because these legs, just looking at it, feel very short. They just look short. And I feel like if I threw on some Dime Novel Legend or even Marauder legs, it would give them you know, maybe a quarter inch height boost. And then it would get a full paint job. Uh, I like it. I might turn this into like a Wasteland Cowboy Survivor type for my ATR universe. And he comes with a backpack. It's like a translucent purple. It's got some chains on it. I have never played this game, so I know nothing about what these things are for, but whatever. And he also comes with a pickaxe. It's got the translucent purple on the top. Actually like that one. That one's kind of neat. That'll go to someone on some other character. And then of course the previously mentioned shotgun. Now this is the figure that I bought this set for. Uh, different articulation. It's got uh, the swivel hips. It's got double jointed knees. It's got the rocker ankles and swivel. It does not have waist articulation and has the mid torso. The head goes up and down, turns, shoulders, and single elbows, and those are really tight. Oh yeah. And then the hands. He doesn't come with any accessories. The colors are neat. Uh, it's like weird gold. Makes me think of uh, the face. Makes me think of Homer Simpson. I mean, that totally looks like a Homer Simpson head. Size comparison, it is quite a bit larger. dig it my when I first saw it my immediate thought was I would swap out the legs for some suit legs maybe off of a, like a Marvel Universe Drax figure and then make him sort of a swap out the head for something I don't know what I would use probably that Drax head again because it's got the it's one of the bigger heads paint the the suit legs 
and then do flesh tone on the top. These, all these little things are actually carved into the sculpt. They're, they're a part of the sculpt. So I would turn them into like scars. Uh, and then it would be like this big brute. Or I can swap out the head and turn it into a zombie, like a big brute zombie guy. Lots of possibilities. It's just very rare to see different body types. Uh, it's good to see new body types coming out because people come in different sizes, right? And so that's why I got this one, was this figure here. I, I dig it. It looks like it's cast in the, this yellow gold plastic. And yeah. So I'd pop the legs off, pop some suit, suit pant legs on there, pop off the head, keep everything else, paint it, uh, call it a day. I like these feet, the bare feet. Maybe even put those on those suit legs if they have the same type of connection. So he's like a barefooted guy in pants. Oh uh, yeah, this guy is great. Lots of cool details. I really like this jacket. I like the shotgun shells. So whatever I do with him, he's definitely going to have a shotgun because that's what he's carrying. I like the lasso. I like all the little stitching. Definitely looks like a coat that's been through some stuff. Yeah. I like the I like dreads. I dig it. So... I, I'm definitely going to swap the leg on this and then paint it up. So there you go. Super quick. I like them. They're neat. Uh, I ended up getting it super cheap. It was probably, I think it was marked at 27 but then I used all my discounts and Target coupon and stuff, and I got it for like 15 For 15 it's worth it. For 27 I don't know if it's worth it, but... You get two figures, so I guess it is. There you go. Fortnite Deadfire versus Mega Cube Brute. Take it easy, everyone.